a lot of parentheses here, but it's 30 times 2b over c plus 2b is 15 times c over c plus 2b is n, so that's 16. b plus 15 c over c plus 2b. It's all over the same denominator. So take out the 15. That's 4b plus c over c plus 2b. How about I try to make that numerator denominator look look alike? That's 15 times. Uh, so the numerator, I'm going to split that c plus 2b plus 2b. Okay, over c plus 2b. It's the same as c plus 4b is c plus 2b plus 2b. Because then what I'm going to do is then take that and say, split that numerator. Say, okay, that's c plus 2b over c plus 2b plus 2b over c plus 2b. Goes in. So it's 15 times 1 plus 2b over c plus 2b. Equals in. Okay, so. 15 times 1 is 15 plus, okay, 2b over c plus 2b. So tb, 2b has to be less than c plus 2b. So this fraction here is less than 1. But how does it compare to, say, like, let's say 2 thirds? Because I have 2 in the numerator, and maybe it could compare to 2 thirds. Well, c plus 2b, okay. If we had 2b over 3b, that would be 2 thirds. But c is less than b. So c plus 2b can't be 3b, because b plus 3b is 3b, but it's c plus, sorry, b plus 2b is 3b, but it's c plus 2b, and c is less than b. So c plus 2b has to be less than 3b, so that makes this whole fraction greater than 2 thirds. So it's 15 plus something that is uh, between, uh, you know, 15 times something but greater than two-thirds but less than one so it's like 15 plus something that's greater than 10 but less than 15. okay so it could be just 27 it has to be between like 25 and 30.